Hello, I'd like to share with you how to create groups for your Google Apps for Education domain. We're going to start by going to the console, the admin console at admin.google.com. And you're going to start by going into Apps. And then we're going to be going into Google Apps. And I found this. Um, I think you can go to Groups for Business, but I found this by going into the Gmail app. And then from here, you go into email addresses. And under email addresses, it says need to create an email distribution list. Why, yes. So we're going to create and manage groups that you can email and share a doc with. And so if you're a Google Apps for Education school, this would be a perfect platform to create a district staff list, a grade level list, a school site list, and so on. So I'm going to click in the bottom right hand corner, create group. And I'm going to name the group. I'm going to call this test group. I'm going to um, add the test group email. So this would be test group at mrtolman.com. That's my Google Apps for Education domain name. And then I can put a description in here. And I can determine the access. It can either be public. Uh, anyone in mrtolman.com can, can join, post messages, view member list, read the archives, so on. Team, only managers can invite new members. Announce only, only managers can post messages. Restricted, only managers can invite new members. So if you wanted to have um, control over this list, um, you would choose restricted. Um, but I'm going to go public just for fun. And if I wanted to create a list with every user, in my domain, I can click this and click Create. And here's my test group. I can add more people to the group by typing in their names. So whatever name I have in my um, in my email contacts, I can add those. Um, I can change the group info. I can manage users in the test group or in this group. Let's see what that looks like. I'm not going to mess with that. And the last thing I wanted to show you was um, aliases. So this is. This is the name of the group email, but I can add another email address where people can email the test group. So that is how you create a group within the Google Apps for Education admin console.